What is good YouTube? Back again with another video. Today, these are the Jordan 1 Baron. back to another sneaker review. Finally, my pickup drought is finally over. As you guys know, last month I lucked out in every sneaker release and I finally came back with a sneaker pickup for retail. Luckily, they did release these out here in the Philippines in a large amount of quantity. I scooped these up at about 9 p.m. at Nike Park with super ease. Now let's bring these out the box. And as you can see, they did give us that OG Jordan 1 box. And right off the box, these are real dope. Man, you can smell the smell right off the bat. Yes, very strong, very reminiscent to the OG1 breads and the Royals, same smell you get. This sneaker is part of the Barons pack, which they also released in a Jordan 9, which I also saw at the shop, but rather skipped on because I wasn't feeling the whole silhouette of the 9. The history behind these sneakers is when Michael Jordan first retired to pursue his baseball career in 1994 with the Barons to which we all know was probably one of Michael Jordan's worst career moves ever. What's funny about that is the Space Jam movie that he did make later on, which mocked and made fun of his baseball career. Reason why they released a Jordan 9 Barons is because at the time, that is the Jordan that they had for him, and the ones because that was when they were first retroing the Jordan 1. Enough about that history lesson, let's get into these sneakers. Overall quality of the sneaker is super, super dope. Leather on these are on point. You see premature creases all throughout the sneaker right out the box. You have a black Nike swoosh on the side panel as well as in the remedial side of the sneaker. You have hints of black wrapping around the toe box. What makes this Jordan 1 different from the other OG ones is the use of new buck suede on the heel and around the ankle collar. You have your OG Air Jordan Wings logo found on the outside of the ankle collar. What I found most dope about this sneaker is the use of the pinstripe inside the inner of the sneaker to give it more of that baseball look. They continue that pinstripe theme with the laces using that 3M reflective which can be seen with flash or any kind of light. The laces also cover a black tongue with a wolf gray Nike Air logo on the top. And finally you have a white clean midsole that sits on a wolf gray bottom outsole. And to finish it all off, you have your Nike logo on the middle. These also do come with an extra set of gray laces, but who would want to change these gray laces when you have these dope ass 3M reflective laces? Yo, that's like replacing your dad's Porsche to your mom's minivan to a hot day. I can't wait to put these on feet. I want to try something new with my on feet portion of this video, so I hope you guys enjoy. this review on these Air Jordan 1 Barons. These are super dope. I hope I gave you guys another view of how these look like on feet. I know a lot of you guys were on the edge of copying them. I hope I gave you guys a better look on these. And I also hope you guys like my new on feet. I'm always trying to do different things 
to keep you guys entertained. Any kind of feedback is appreciated, so let me know down below if you guys did enjoy that. And now for my two shout outs for this video. First shout out goes to my boy Sneaker Squared. He is also a YouTuber out here in the Philippines. He does sneaker reviews. He has his own channel. His link will be down in the description below. Do check him out. And for my second shout out goes out to Fresh Prince of Jordan. He as well does sneaker reviews on YouTube. Do check him out. I believe he got the Jordan 9 Barons. So if you guys wanted to see that review, do check out his channel. His link will also be down in the description below. You guys have been an amazing crowd. I thank you guys all the time. If you guys enjoyed this video, the best way of letting me know is hitting that like button down below. And if you haven't already, please do subscribe. With all that being said, I thank you guys again for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace. The Manila Sunset though.